anything. Sonya Strong is going up against Ivelisse. JD. Sonya Strong looks to start 2018 off on a strong foot after impressive victories over many notable names in the wrestling industry. Tonight, she goes up against another one. Lucha Underground stable, Ivelisse. Happy Wear the Fury. Well, right now, ladies and gentlemen, we have Private Party making their way to the ring. They are looking to address the House of Glory faithful as they're gaining some momentum right now in the House of Glory tag team division. Private Party looking to get back into title contention. I've always said that Private Party needs to get on the same page and do things a little bit more seriously. They can still party. But they want to get back into title contention and that's exactly what they've been doing. Mark Wen, Isaiah Cassidy having a good time. And Romeo Romano blindsiding Private Party! Oh my God! Absolutely no reason! They don't even have their coats off! Romeo Romano slams Mark Quinn on the hardwood floor! Ruby DeLuna obviously pleased by what she sees! Romeo has a microphone now. Gentlemen, what a disgusting act. If Mr. Romano wants this question answered, why didn't they invite him to their private party? What does Ruby DeLuna have that he doesn't? I mean, it doesn't take a rocket scientist to figure that one out. I don't blame private party whatsoever. As Isaiah Cassidy tried to fight two on one here. I mean, I think everybody watching at home is thinking the same thing. You guys would invite Ruby DeLuna to your party. As well. Irish whip here, double team. Romano up and over to the outside. Jenkins with a big boot to the face. Big tilt to world DDT. It looks like we have an impromptu match here, ladies and gentlemen. Private party blindsided. Well, the Hollywood's top models. All starting over the fact that Private Party invited Ruby DeLuna to their private party. And here comes Mark Wen with the tag. Suicide dive through the ropes. Right on to Romano. And again on the opposite side to Sasha Jenkins. Mark Wen absolutely on fire here. At kicking it old school. Look at that. This is exactly what I was talking about, ladies and gentlemen. Private party needs to do this exactly. Springboard missile drop kick and a beauty. Private Party wants to be back in contention for the House of Glory Tag Team titles. Off the top, Summer Salt seated Senton and he lands on his feet.
And you can hear the House of Glory faithful appreciating the athleticism of one Mark Quint. And he doesn't appear to be finished just yet. As Sasha Jenkins is in the landing zone. Mark Quint up top. Shooting, stop, press, and a beauty. One. And Romano breaks that up very, very quickly. The House of Glory Tag Team Division is looking very competitive in 2018 and these are two of the teams that are making it very competitive as Romano and Quinn going back and forth. Look at that overhead Pele kick. Mark Quinn again doing what he does best. Going up top. Will be DeLuna down below. Saying something to the referee. Mark Quinn really doesn't care. Goes for a 450. Rolls through. Romano with a super kick. Tag to Jenkins. Jenkins now the legal man. Overhead pump handle. Nicely done by Jenkins. Goes for the cover. One, two. And Isaiah Cassidy breaks that up. Jenkins makes the quick tag back into Romano as Isaiah Cassidy now. And Romano go one on one. Big Itsuguri. Jenkins with that big pool. Jenkins now. Placing Isaiah Cassidy on the top turnbuckle. What does he have planned here? Private party not afraid to try a new drink or two on the menu. As Isaiah Cassidy's trying to fight out of this the best that he can. Floats over. Mark Quinn jumps up. Head scissors into a corner. Cassidy off the ropes. Takes out Romano. One, two. Quinn and Cassidy with a big victory over the Hollywood's top models here at Kicking It Old School. Ladies and gentlemen, Private Party continues that momentum as they look to once again challenge for the House of Glory Tag Team Championships. I wonder if now's the right time to tell the Hollywood's top models that Private Party even invited Shapiro to their private party. Either way, both Mark Quinn and Isaiah Cassidy are going to be celebrating tonight. And the Hollywood top models, well, they were just bounced from the club. House of Glory Wrestling returns to the Elks Lodge on Friday, May 18th, as we present Fair Warning. Come see the talented House of Glory roster in action, as well as in-ring competition from Jeff Cobb, Shane Strickland, and Santana Garrett. For tickets and more information on this event, head over to HOGWrestling.net. This is the Prince of Pro Wrestling, Pro Wrestling's only true independent contractor telling you to subscribe to the House of Glory YouTube page. Reverse German suplex! The beautiful cross body off the top! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I am here tonight at House of Glory kicking it old school with the legend himself, Mean Gene Oakland. Gene, how's your experience so far at House of Glory? I gotta tell you something, it has been exciting thus far. I've got a chance to talk to a lot of people. This is my kind of a joint. A uh, place. <laughs> Did I say joint? That's all right by me. If you guys want to see more legends like me and Gene Oakland, visit the website, hogwrestling.net. <laughs> by Jake Roberts, the snake. 
Next week on HOG Live, we will see the Crown Jewel Championship defended as ACH comes to House of Glory looking to take the gold away from Evander James. We'll see a Lucha showdown as Montequilla goes one-on-one -on -one with Juventud Guerrero. Plus, after surviving a hellacious battle with Low Key, the Amazing Red addresses the House of Glory faithful about his future with the company. All this goes down next Thursday on a brand new episode of HOG Live. Close for that Phil Nelson suplex. Yes! One, He's got the pin two, and a bridge! Three. in one of her hardest fought battles to date. Wait a second. Wait a minute. Sue Young dropped in the ring a double choke. We are here with Sonya Strong. She just finished up her match. Great victory, Sonya. Violet comes in, steals your thunder. What do you think? I have no idea who did what after my match. What I do know is I'm victorious, and I'm doing exactly what I said I was going to do when I started this women's division. I'm putting every single female on notice that's out there. If you come into House of Glory, understand that I am who represents this company. Anything you see other than what Sonya Strong is doing doesn't matter. It's now time for our main event as Sonya Strong is set to take on Evil East. And joining me on commentary at this time, my very special guest, the House of Glory Women's Champion. Getting ready to make her House of Glory debut, Ivelisse, who issued this challenge to Sonya Strong. What's up, this is Ivelisse, a.k.a. the baddest bitch in the building, a.k.a. La Cigaria. And I finally have arrived to House of Glory. So how about I waste no time and go straight to the point? How about I waste no time and put the division on notice. How about I waste no time and call out who I want to wrestle? Sonia Strong. Sonia, let's see how strong
Zony Strong has put some extra preparation into this match, stating that Ivelisse is an opponent she's been looking forward to facing for a very long time. The self-proclaimed queen of House of Glory looks to continue her recent hot streak when she takes on Ivelisse after the break. House of Glory Wrestling returns to the Elks Lodge on Friday, May 18th, as we present Fair Warning. Come see the talented House of Glory roster in action, as well as in-ring competition from Jeff Cobb, Shane Strickland, and Santana Garrett. For tickets and more information on this event, head over to HOGWrestling.net. Yo, listen, this is King Ricochet here. I want you guys to know, if you're based in New York or wherever, actually, if you want to become a professional wrestler, I suggest you join House of Glory Wrestling School. This place is awesome. Take it from me. You can get a free hat. Do it. Versus Sonia Strong, and I have a much more beautiful replacement as Thank Matthew Ryan you. Shapiro's cardio got the best of him tonight. House of Glory Women's Champion Violet's joining me at commentary. The first ever women's champion. Release with the go behind and overpowers Sonia immediately early in this contest. Ivelisse. Former contestant on WWE's Tough Enough. Notable victories over Paige and Natalia. Also, a former trios champion in Lucha Underground. Sonia, her resume speaks for itself. Victories over Tessa Blanchard, Mia Yim, amongst others. Beautiful sweep by Sonia, as Ivelisse backs herself into the corner. Violet, being that I have you out here now, do you mind telling us who your bodyguard is after all these weeks? My hired arm? Your hired arm. She, she, <laughs> um, she, I found she, and she, Look, I don't need to answer your question. She makes me unstoppable. Sonia Strong fighting back here. Eva yeah. Lee's just overpowering Sonia here. Face to face, Eva Lee wants nothing to do with Sonya here. Big close line. Uh. What a Pele kick by Sonya. Eva Lee is out on her feet. Big drop kick into the corner.
Being that everything that has happened so far, Violet, how can you condone your actions with the House of Glory Women's Championship? What is your vision for the House of Glory Women's Championship? What are you What are you talking about? Uh, did you not see last show? Last show, I defended my title. One, two, three, Sue Young. Were you not there? Did you not see that? Of course I was there. I was sitting right here. My vision. Well, House of Glory management doesn't want to give anybody else any shine, any time, any time to prove myself, so I had to do what I had to do. Can you see yourself making this, this title as prestigious as Rob wants it to be? I already have made it pre prestigious. There are some in, in management that don't agree with your actions. That's why I raised the question. Listen, you're going to see. You're going to see tonight as well. Ivelisse in control of Sonia Strong. Violet joining me on commentary. Last time we were in the NYC arena, Sonia defeated Sue Young in what I thought was her toughest challenge to date. Definitely. Those stiff shots by Ivelisse. Sonia really on the ropes. She should kick her harder. And Sonia is in trouble. Ivelisse goes for a quick cover. Jack Knight cover here. One, two. Two count. Sonia looking to add to her resume as the queen of House of Glory. Ha. <laughs> Even after everything, Violet, you have to admire what the women in House of Glory are doing. Many feel that you're disrespecting the women's championship here in House of Glory. Uh, I disagree. How can anyone prove themselves? How can anyone even... They don't give any spot to anyone other than one person. How can anyone prove themselves? How can I make this title prestigious so you, without you, you matches? Can, you can don't attacking make my management. own matches. You can don't attacking management and taking the title. You gotta do what you gotta do. Fisherman suplex there by Ivelisse. Listen, half of these people are just chanting for Ivelisse because of her, her tiny little... Are they even called pants? Ivelisse choking. Sonia out using the referee's five count to her advantage. Beautiful. Dragon suplex with a bridge there. Evil East with a two count. Rolls through. She has that hold applied still, putting all that pressure on Sonia's neck. And Sonia reverses that into a beautiful armbar. Center of the ring. You know, it's just not fair. How can I have one match, what, what, two what matches? Is it, what is it fair? That's the fact that you're keeping that title away from two, everybody else two in the matches, women's division? Two matches. Third one is a hardcore match. I go through a table, and then that's it. I just get shelved for the rest of my young career. Nobody's saying, nobody saying you had to be shoved. But that's exactly what happened. Hard work pays off. Stealing the title does not. It's paying off. Beautiful move there by Ivelisse. Sonia's face planted right into the mat. Going for the old school move, surfboard here. That's exactly what it is. Sonia right in the center of the ring, nowhere to go. Looking to fight herself out of this position. 
And Ivelisse is pulling the hair. One for DDT there, didn't get all of it, two count. Two count only there by Ivelisse. Violet, what makes you think the House of Glory Women's Championship would be better off in your hands than, say, an Ivelisse or a Mia Yim, a Sue Young, a Tessa Blanchard, all these great women that have competed in House of Glory? Oh, I, what are you going to bring to the title? I think that... I should be the one defending the championship against all those women. I should be getting experience. I should be growing. I should be growing my name, expanding my brand. And how would that ever happen when I don't even get a match? Eva Lee's now with a submission hold right in the middle of the ring here again on Sonya Strong. Sonya nowhere to go. Fighting back up to a vertical base. Ivelisse has powered Sonya down to the mat most of this contest. Usually it's the other way around. Huh. But Ivelisse, instead of toying with the House of Glory Faithful, needs to keep on Sonya strong. Don't turn your back. That was classy. And Sonya now trying to fight back. Shots to the midsection. Ivelisse with that waist lock. Again, go behind. Sonya reverses it. Off the ropes. Big spine buster there by Sonya. Finally, a big offensive maneuver to create some separation between her and Ivelisse. women seemingly back up at the same time. Big knife edge shot. Sonia retaliates with one of her own. And Sonia with those repeated strikes. Misses that big boot, does he believe? Big knife edge shot, takes her down. Sonia mounting a comeback here. Spin kick. And another roundhouse. God. And a beautiful Hurricane Rana takes Evelise Stuck down to the mat. One, two. That was two beautiful. Count. Two count only. Sonia now going for that full Nelson suplex. Eva Lisa is trying her best to fight it off. Has Sonia well scouted. Eva Lisa with a big kick to the head. Sonia backed into the corner. Rolls through. Eva Lisa with that big roundhouse kick. One, two. Two count only, Sonia survives. Just a little bit longer, Ivelisse. You can see the frustration mounting on Ivelisse. This is the competition you are set to face, Violet. This is the competition. I'm ready. Did you not just see me pin, Su Young? Especially with my little friend over here? Ivelisse, nobody's home, runs into the turnbuckle. She hits the mat. Sonia now ascending the heights. 
Perched up top, Ivelisse back up. And Ivelisse wisely runs into the ropes. now beautiful move there variation of a stunner with the jackknife cover too and Sonia powers out Ivelisse showing again frustration taking her anger out on Sonia blaming the referee Sonia is just a fighter. Ivelisse took too much time. Sonia here. Look at that! To that House of Glory Women's Championship. How do you come to my school and you you issue an open challenge to all the women in House of Glory, and you come here and all your moves are stolen from our trainer, and then you lose? What a joke! Sonia and Ivelisse exchanging words in the middle of that ring, ladies and gentlemen. And no matter how much she didn't want to do it, Ivelisse showing sportsmanship tonight to Sonia. What a moment here at Beware the Fury. Sonia Strong with an impressive victory. Over Evil East. You want me to make this prestigious? What do you got planned here, Vi? What is this? Why? What business You're is it of hers to, to be in the ring now with Evil East? Violet just got up from the commentary booth. Wait a minute. Jumping on Ivelisse's back here. Locks in that sleeper. She's just choking out Ivelisse here. Once again, stealing Sonia's moment. Timekeeper's ringing the bell. Get an official out here. the championship. Violet once again reaping the benefits of Sonya's spotlight laying waste to Ivelisse in the middle of that ring. Something needs to be done. 